Hello and welcome to another Mad Hatter review. Today we are taking a look at the Conan the Barbarian Super 7 Deluxe figure. I hope I said all of that right. Um, this is, um, if you do or don't know, this is the uh, uh, 1970s comic version of Conan the Barbarian. Uh, it's not the the it's not the Arnold movie, although they do have one. They do have a set that's uh, that's coming out, or, or uh, yeah, a wave that's coming out. But uh, this was its own standalone thing. Um, again, it's based on the uh, on the 1970s comic. Uh, Super Seven put this up for pre order. 17 years ago and it's just coming out now i don't know i think it's, it's been a while i think it's like last year or something they put it out but it's it's been forever uh but it's finally out and i'm really excited to open this so without further ado let's go ahead and pop this sucker open and see what we got um i'm pretty excited it's been ages since i've gotten a super seven figure i think the last one was the master of the universe wave but uh let's take a look at this so ooh, right away the package art looks phenomenal. So you have the, the 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 famous comic cover. He's got the spear. He's got the horns, and uh, they do they just do a great job with their packaging. It kind of makes me not want to even open it. Although I'm an out of the box guy with figures, so I will be opening this. But uh, back of it, you got sort of the Conan the Barbarian with the uh, with the lightning here, and uh, this looks like it's uh, like it's a sleeve. So we're gonna go ahead and pop this open. Oh. And there we go. So, um, and we're gonna we're gonna take some some pictures outside of the box, but uh, just so everybody can see right here. And I know that there's super glare on this, but yeah, you've got the cone and the barbarian. You got the sword. You got the spear. I think there's a dagger. There's this uh, waist dagger, and then you got the two the two heads. So, um, let's go ahead and open them up, and uh, we will uh, we'll see. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at our Conan here out of the package. So right away, pretty solid figure. Obviously a four horseman sculpt uh, all the way. Um, accessories are real nice. We'll get into that in a second here, but just in terms of what's on his person. So you have the head, and we'll talk about the head in a second, but you have the helmet with the horns. You have the hair sort of blown in the wind. And, uh, you know, he's not wearing much. He's got this uh, uh, golden uh, belt right here. He's got the... Uh, 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 the, the fur, uh, you know, the fur underwear. Um, and then he's got this, uh, this awesome necklace. I love how the necklace came out with the sort of the three, um, the three, uh, 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 symbols, I guess you'd call them, but, uh, sort of three structure necklace. And then, uh, um, the, uh, the sandals, the sandals are sort of a great, uh, are done really, really well. Um, especially for, uh, for an articulated figure on his belt, you have a dagger. Now the dagger is removable. Mine is a little tricky. It kind of comes off pretty easily. Um, it's got this little, uh, uh, this little uh, 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 nub in here, and you can kind of stuff it in there into the little ridge. Um, it needs a little bit of, uh, see, it, it pops off a little easily. Um, I might end up just putting, not, I don't know, some glue on there, or maybe you know, some some tape or something. But uh, um, it, I am happy it is removable though, because it would affect its posability. Um, and uh, finally, let me just jump into the accessories here. So you have a sword, a pretty standard golden sword, or sorry, a golden hilt, silver. And then you have this this uh, spear. Now, I really, really like this spear. Um, it's got these uh, these uh, spirals around it. And um, at the uh, at the top uh, on the spearhead, it's got these uh, spikes. And that's really nice, too. I haven't seen a spear like this uh, before. Um, uh, the last thing I want to talk about is the head. So you have the head and you have the alternate head. Um, and, um, the one thing is, if you look at the, the, the promo photo for this, um, the head was different. Um, the eyes in the, in the production looks like it's almost like, I mean, it's almost like war paint. Um, and, uh, the other one has it on too. As you can see, there's a lot of black around the eyes. Now the production photos don't look like this. There's, there's no black around the eyes. Um, but I, I honestly, I thought I would hate this. And then as it, it just kind of grew on me, I kind of like this war paint version a little more than the photos that they showed. I mean, that's my own personal preference, but uh, but yeah, um, these are. I, I still think these are really really solid heads. So you obviously the screaming one and sort of the stoic one. And now in terms of uh, joints, now you know if you're familiar with any four horsemen buck, you know it's got the standard. You got the shoulder ball joints. You have the ball joints at the head. Now this doesn't move as much as I would like because of the hair kind of keeping it down, but uh, you know it it moves enough. Then you have the uh, the swivel at the wrists. You have the bend at the wrist. You have the buck, of course. You have the uh, the, the ball joints at the uh, 
at the groin area. Then you have the knee. It's not a double joint, but uh, bends enough. And then you have the uh, the uh, uh, the ball joint at the uh, at the ankle, and then the uh, the bend at the ankle as well. Um, so, uh, and is there a brace? Well, no, brace is almost. But but uh, yeah, it's uh, just a really cool, solid figure. This will work perfectly if you are a collector of the master of the universe classics or the thundercats uh, this will fit right in um so i'm gonna i'm gonna display mine over there as well and uh, just kind of decide which head i'm gonna use but uh yeah really cool solid figure super seven still doing stuff i think you can still get it on their site but uh real real badass rendition of the 1970s conan and uh and yeah love this figure love this spear man i really really like the spear but uh let us know what you think. Comment, subscribe, and uh, uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully, you can still get your hands on them. Uh, that is it. Bye bye.